Megan Parks with Exploring Parks here. Today let's talk about how you can attach your sleeping bag to your backpack to keep it secure and dry. So when you're backpacking, keeping your sleeping bag safe and dry is one of the most important tasks because it's part of your survival gear. So if you don't have a sleeping bag at night because it got wet or you lost it, you would be up a creek if it's really cold weather. So you wanna make sure that you know exactly how to attach your sleeping bag to your backpack. There are several options that you can choose from, but really the best way to decide how to attach your sleeping bag to your backpack is going to depend on the design of your backpack. There are two types of backpacks that you can choose from when you're shopping for a backpacking backpack. There's an external frame, which is like this one, where the framing is on the outside of your backpack, and there's an internal frame backpack, like this one, where you cannot see the actual frame system because it's inside of the backpack you'll be able to choose which is best for you based on your comfort level and also your needs. So for example, I use this backpack because I just use it for backpacking. It fits well, it's comfortable to carry for me, but my husband uses this backpack because it is better for holding larger capacities like weight. So if you're out hunting and you kill game, then you're able to pack it into this backpack and it carries better because of that external frame on it. Now regardless of which backpack you choose, the systems on the outside for attaching gear are going to look different across the board. So you need to decide which is best on your own backpack. Just to be upfront in this video, my husband and I both put our sleeping bags inside our backpack for the most protection. So we feel like it's really important that our sleeping bags do not get wet and they do not fall off without us knowing it while we're hiking. So we keep our sleeping bags in our backpack at the very bottom so that they're always with us and they're safe from getting wet. On my backpack, there's actually a sleeping bag compartment at the very bottom. So you're able to put the sleeping bag in the bottom by just zipping a little compartment, sliding it in there, and zipping it back up. That way you can access it without having to empty all your gear out of your backpack. And it keeps it nice and tight against the bottom of the bag so I have more room for the rest of my gear. If your backpack has a sleeping bag compartment, I recommend using it, but I know some people that do not like using that space for their sleeping bag, so they remove the panel that separates the sleeping bag from the rest of their gear and just pack as normal. If you don't have room in your backpack, then you need to decide on the best way to attach it to the outside. So let's talk about a few of your options. You can also pack your sleeping bag under the hood of your backpack if you have a backpack with a, you know, a hood that's designed to fit it. This could be a good option because that hood does give a little bit of extra protection to your sleeping bag. If it were to start raining, at least it's covered a little little bit, but you do want to be careful if it's on the top of your backpack that it doesn't get rained on and also that the rain doesn't get into your backpack because the hood's no longer securely over the opening. A third option is to use any outer straps that are on your backpack. So some backpacks are designed to have lots of straps so that you can securely put your sleeping bag, your tent, your sleeping mat, all those larger items. You can roll it and snap it in place on the outside of your backpack. If your backpack doesn't have straps on it, you could always purchase your own compression straps to wrap around your sleeping bag. So for example, our sleeping bags have compression straps attached to them, but you can purchase your own and then wrap it around the sleeping bag to tighten it, and then you can attach these straps to your backpack, depending on what attachment points you have. So compression straps are another great option when you're trying to attach your sleeping bag to your backpack. If your sleeping bag did not come with a stuff sack that it has compression straps on it, you could purchase a compression sack for your sleeping bag. So for example, this sleeping bag, I mean it's already pretty um, tight, but I could always shove it inside a bag that is waterproof and also will like kind of vacuum seal it down and then I can hang this off the outside of my backpack. So you do have the option of getting another storage bag that will fit your sleeping bag in it and be able to attach to the outside of your backpack. Or you could choose to get a compression sack that is waterproof, regardless of if you're going to put it inside or outside your backpack, just to have that extra layer of protection. If you're in a pinch, you can always bring paracord with you to tie your sleeping bag to your backpack. This seems like the riskiest way to me because you have to trust that your knot tying skills are good enough to hold your sleeping bag to your backpack without falling off at any point. 
So you can just wrap your paracord twice like a bedroll around your sleeping bag and then figure out how to attach that with maybe compression straps or carabiners or anything else to hold it to your backpack. You could also bring a bungee cord with you to wrap around your sleeping bag and then attach to any of the tie points on your backpack to hold that in place. Carabiners are a great option to attach gear to your backpack, so if it's possible and your sleeping bag sack has a loop on it, you could always try to just carabiner it to your backpack. It might flail around a little bit, but it could be the best option for you. The last choice that I want to mention is just leaving your sleeping bag unrolled loose in your backpack. So I've seen some people do this because they think it gives them more space for other gear. So if you want to do this, you would just take your sleeping bag out of the storage sack it comes with and loosely kind of shove it down into your backpack and then you can pack your gear inside that sleeping bag or along the sides of the sleeping bag, wherever it all fits the best. I hope this video gave you a better idea of all of your options for attaching your sleeping bag to your backpack. Regardless of how you attach it, you just want to make sure that it's secure and will stay dry during your whole trip. If you're looking for tips, tricks, and gear review for camping and other adventures, please follow us on exploringparks.com and also subscribe to this channel. Thanks guys, keep exploring!